dead, bro. What? <sighs> Can we pull it off? Can we pull it off? I Honestly, I don't even know, man, like, what's gonna happen this episode in order to move things to the next level or whatnot, you know what I mean? But you know what? Without further ado, let's jump right into this. Hendrickson is here, he's active. Ixu is this a backstory? Uh-huh. It's so crazy, like, Hendrickson wanted to do all this. Dreyfus is now with the people he wanted to revive. You know what I'm starting to realize? I should have kind of... Okay. Interesting. What's the truth? What's the truth? That Dreyfus is a demon? Like, what is that? Like, that we don't know what really went down? Grimoire, this is what you want to do while we're in front of a demon? This is what you want to do? Come on, bro. Another time. Come on. I never understand this mentality. Like, oh yeah, I want to fight you because of what you did to me. And then there's a freaking something behind us that can kill us both. But you want to focus on me. Me. You know what, let's fight this thing and then you can kill me. I'll give my life up happily. Like, what the heck, bro? I never understood that. So, what I was going to say, I should have realized the Ten Commandments were strong when they easily took down Hendrickson by themselves. Like, they literally had a free-for-all with this dude Hendrickson. They beat him so badly. And Meliodas worked so hard to beat Hendrickson. I mean, of course, I'll give Hendrickson the benefit of the doubt. He was at a weak state, but I don't know. Oh, I love when they just scream, hey, hey. Is Flo the same band that made the um, Code Geass opening? I think that's them, right? Or is that Colors? I don't think, where do I remember Flo from? Wait, or is it, is the song Flo from Flo called Colors? I don't know, honestly. I'm trying to remember where I remember them from, because I know that name. I'm like, oh, Flo, Flo, you know what I mean? But I don't know where. And, and no, I'm not thinking of Flo from Progressive, obviously. I'm thinking of Flo, the band. Atoning Great Holy Night. I just, can we fight and stop talking to each other right now? Bro! This guy is something else. Work together, your dad is alive. Oh, I remember this attack. The dark snow one. Look at that, it didn't even hurt him. Oh wait, yes it did. Damn! Grimoire, are you kidding me, bro? The only way we can win is if four of us fight and you're acting like a little baby, bro.
Can you help, guys? He's getting beat! Okay. Look at how Hendrickson fights! It's like he fights kind of proper and stuff, you know? Okay, that wasn't that bad. What? Oh. Oh, druids. Okay. Okay. Let's see what he got to say. The fact that they just slide in there like with no remorse or like no thought of the world. They're like, oh, so let's just go in there and see what happened. I gotta give it to them. That's bravery, yo. I would never do this, man. I'm, no way. Look at how far that. No. Sorry. I'll look from above. Okay. Damn, that has to be the worst. As a child? Dead bodies? That's scarring. Yeah, that can scar you for life. That's, that's not funny, man. That's sad. Okay. to you too like what the heck you guys seem so cool back not cool but so good 
What the hell happened? Wanted to kill Zataras, wanted to kill each other, then it's like, what, you know? Oh. Demon. It's just a sh shadow, though. Like, not a shadow, but a gas of a demon. So is this like a host demon? You know it's crazy because I just finished watching Venom the other day and it's similar to this kind of... Look at that, so he manages to, to get his. Okay, I see what happened. Okay, interesting. So he gave up his own body to save Hendrickson. So why was Hendrickson being evil and all that then? saying why Meliodas, he killed Liz, bro. I'm gonna need that to fuel you up with something. I'm not gonna lie, that was a terrible performance from Meliodas from Deanne. Mer Come on, Meliodas, you don't deserve to hold boobs right now. You don't deserve it. You failed us. No boobs. <laughs> like what? <laughs> oh, 
he managed to get hit. I forgot we have magic that we can just fix people's arms and stuff. That's pretty cool. Magic is awesome. Oh, don't worry. Merlin will be okay. She's going to break out right now. Just wait. She put you in the cube, bro. Yo. Blushing Slater, what is there? That's making you blush like that. Is she, what do you, all right, so what, can you go to your body, Merlin, or no? Venus, treasure out, okay. Yeah, he did it. We just beat us with pure strength. Yes, it was humiliating. I was watching like I couldn't believe it. Hmm, I think they can pull it through though, you know, obviously. Give up. So what do we do? I see what you're saying. But you can't become strong that fast. Okay, that's not that bad. But one demon clan member is probably the level of all of us together. Yeah, look, see, he's more than us, I think. Yikes.
Don't say that, Arthur. You you got power. We believe in you, bro. Arthur, I'm gonna need you to be on Elizabeth's level right now. Who? Vaughn? Escanor. Oh, yeah, we have one more. I forgot his name. I, I mean, obviously they said it now, Escanor. I forgot all about him. That's what I mean. Escanor. Why didn't you- Oh yeah, cause Bond didn't come with him, of course. Oh, I wonder how Deanne is gonna react when she sees King. Or is she too hurt? Nah, no way. Yeah. Who are you? No! Don't! Don't F with me again, bro! What? Yo, what is this? This is what? Yo. This whole time, I'm like, bro, Deanne is gonna see King and she's gonna be like, Oh, King! And they're gonna be loving and then she's gonna give him a kiss. And then they're gonna be together and prosper. And no! She goes, who are you? What? Because she hit her... So does she not remember Meliodas and them? I mean, obviously with stuff like this, you gain your memory back after, after a long period of time. But what is this, dude? Oh my gosh, yo. <sighs> this is such a loss, man. This is such a L. I cannot believe the type of L we took. Like, everyone got beaten. Deanne forgot everything. Bond left. We still gotta find Escanor, but we don't know where Escanor is. We're too weak. There's just so many things that went bad here. Oh man, you know it's crazy because this whole time I'm like, yo, bring it on Ten Commandments, we're not scared. I was so confident, I thought we can handle it, you know, we can hold it down, I thought we was like that. I was wrong, I'm sorry Ten Commandments, don't come for us, don't come anymore, straight up. Wait till we get stronger and then you can come, you know what I mean? Like what, man? And I think they may be fighting the Ten Commandments in the previous season too. Because I have seen some clips, I know, you shouldn't spoil yourself and stuff like that with that. Or I don't know, they're fighting a certain force, you know what I mean? But the thing is, like, all the stuff with Seven Deadly Sins, the third season has become like a meme now. So they're just posting it, like, they're like, oh, look at this, look at the animation, look at what they're doing here. They're showing the fights and stuff like that. And you know, it's just like, it's become a meme, so now everyone just knows how bad Seven Deadly Sins Season 3 is. But overall, an enjoyable episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it to the end, you are amazing, yo. Peace! Before ending this video, I want to give a big thanks to my Patreon supporters. Because of you guys, I can make enjoyable content and all the artwork that I love. Thank you so much. I want to give a big shout out to Sienna Cujo, Teddy Vinning, and Tim Kane. Yo, how about the bet? No Bessie, uh I take the wheel, no Tessie, yeah I move too fast, can't catch me, yeah She move too fast, she nasty, what? All of these niggas be the drag queens, bad things happen